Hey guys, I just want to share something with you all. Um, you don't have to believe it. It's up to you because we all have different journey in life. And we also choose certain path in order for us to get to the journey where we're supposed to be. And I know that some people might relate to my story or might relate to my situation. And I just want you to know that you are not alone. There are people out there who have the same experiences as you or kind of like the same journey as you. And just know that you're not crazy or hallucinating. Sometimes people might think of you as crazy or cuckoo, but you know, that is their opinion of you, right? And you may say things to people about certain things, but often they laugh at you or criticize you. And most of the times it does hurt your feelings because they do not understand you, right? And you're the only one who can understand yourself. For me, I'm lucky because despite having a lot of families or a lot of people I know that I share with, they don't believe me. And the only really person who actually believe in me is the person I am with right now, which is far deep. In my whole life, I already thought I am different from everyone else. And that is why I always question everything about what's going on in the world, including people and just life in general. A few months ago, I mentioned here on TikTok that I often see visions and a lot of my visions are often are becoming true. And I thought to myself, is it just a coincidence or it's actually happening? But eventually I found out that it's not a coincidence. It's basically like my guardian angel or my guide was showing me something that I am supposed to know in the future. I know that most of you here don't really know what's going on in my life because I talk a lot of things that are not related to my current journey. My current journey right now is about spiritualism. It's about learning who you are, what kind of person are you, what is your rule here in this world, and what are the things that you're supposed to do to either help the humanity or help the world or what are the things that you can contribute in order for you to help a lot of people in your life. I'm sure a few of you heard my vision that I shared in the past in which eventually I found out that it's, it is slowly happening in reality, which is what's going on now in the world. At the moment, we have been dealing a lot of wars, a lot of things going on in the world. There's a lot of sufferings and agonies and there's just a lot of death. But on top of that, there are a lot of people who are awakening in this whatever is going on right now. And of course, I do consider myself being part of it because part of it too is I did ask God, I asked the universe, my angels, my guide about showing me what is supposed to be the things that I'll be doing here on earth, which I have been shown what my real or my actual rule here on earth. But sometimes I often see visions every night. And the reason why I want to share this is because I want people to know what really is going on in the world and what really the things that we're supposed to be aware of. Either you can help humanity or you can help yourself at the same time. So I visualize a very, very big machine. The machine is already existed. In the, it's already on earth. It's been created already. And the machine is some sort of a nuclear power or weapon against or towards the earth. Yes, I was closing my eyes because I wanted to remember it. So the machine was actually a nuclear weapon that will be used against humanity. The machine is supposed to shoot out a nuclear fire which is really, really big. It was a big, big machine. It could harm a lot of people and 
basically it could harm the entire earth. So when the fire was coming out from that nuclear machine, it's supposed to make the earth into a super dark. It was just super dark. The earth became so dark. And I don't know if you're familiar with the movie The Road. So it's basically like that. And the entire world just turned into darkness. And I saw a lot of people losing their life. I saw a lot of people hurting each other. I also saw um, a lot of grocery stores that are empty. And basically, people were fighting each other because of the food. And in my vision, I also saw a, a machine up in the sky. It's basically, so the other machine earlier that I mentioned was kind of like facing up basically to shoot something up and the other vision that i saw was like a, a machine it's like a laser that it's shooting fire down to earth and i believe that the machine it's already made it's just somewhere on earth or god knows i don't know where this machine came from but basically the machine is a laser okay it's a laser that shoots fire and my other vision also shows something about the earth is going to be full of water. Basically, like the earth turns into water. I don't know. Like, it's basically like um, what happened to Moses situation where there's just a lot of water. And I know, I don't know what the cause was. And also, my other vision was basically the entire world what turns into ice. So... A lot of people suffers from a lot of coldness. They also like a lot of people died from it. And it was just so cold that I saw a bunch of people being, you know, like lots of death. Um, and for me, it was a bit scary. But at the same time, I was telling myself or my guide was telling me that that don't be afraid because you were sent to warn people however it's up to the people if they want to listen or not your rule your job is to tell all these people and if they don't want to listen to you that's okay you cannot force them as long as you're doing your part do your job and continue from there so that's pretty much what I saw. I can tell you more about my spiritual journey and it's really amazing guys.